units during the week. Now, the management of the energy giant visited the NSE to intimate the stock trading community with the latest developments in its first quarter earnings that increased by over a billion naira. I had a chat with the group chief executive, Mr. Wale Tinobu, how, on how the company retreated into profitability and his projections for the oil market. Let's listen. They suffered from the collapse in the oil prices. Um, you know, the oil prices dropped from $100 on average to, to, to $30 per barrel. It's, it's recently recovered to around the $50 mark. And um, we wanted quite a bit, had a, quite a bit of debt. We had extensive projects across the midstream, the upstream, and the downstream. And uh, the first thing we had to do was enter into a five-point restructuring agenda where we sold down some of our assets. We raised over 120 billion naira in cash to reduce our debt. We also restructured our loans, and, um, and the net debt after we paid down, we booked a five-year, 15% per annum loan with the banks. Um, we converted quite a lot of debt into equity and effectively had a leaner balance sheet to ensure that our cash flows supported um, the, 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 the our cost base and our, and our capital base. Uh, so far, we focused on expanding our dollar denominated earnings by increasing production on our upstream assets, by focusing extensively on the export of crude, which we've done successfully, and we've done a lot, quite a lot of importing of petroleum products, and, and we've imported um, a substantial amount of products. You know, over over we, we've done over 13 million barrels of crude on the export side, and on the import side, we've done a substantial amount um, of, 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 of volumes into the country and we still continue to do so. Given the recent relapse in oil price and the fact that OPEC members are considering an extension of oil production cuts, uh, what's your outlook for the oil for the crude oil markets? First of all, I mean, we almost realize that oil is a commodity like any other commodity, so the price will change from time to time. We, we just had a, a, a period between 2009 and you know, 2014 of, of, of superb growth. But the truth about the matter is that um, when you have a downturn like we've, we've had, there's been a substantial amount of reduction in investment. That reduction of investment fails to replace what has been consumed. And what has been consumed on a day-to-day -day basis is declining by anything from 9 to 15 percent per annum. It's a range. You know, oil produced, you start a well, you're producing 100 percent, it will decline naturally until it gets to zero over a period of time, except you reinvest in the field by drilling additional wells.